Hey, how you doing? It's me, Kitte, aka your boy, aka there's no electricity in the new office and this is a battery sign. So I decided to vlog me screwing around, improving certain things which I was postponing because there was electricity and things that are done while there's electricity are more fun than setting up the office. So yeah, let's start. You know how I said I'm supposed to buy new furniture for here? It seems like that's never going to happen because I just removed the doors on this thingy so I can use them as shelves. Now I have to unbox, unbox this puppy and I have to unbox the Brita so we can fill it with water. So those are the two first things on the list. Before I start doing any of that, I'm someone who works good with lists. So we're gonna take this, which is like a whiteboard like thingy and we're gonna stick it to the wall. This is how this works. They send you 25 static writing sheets, that's what they're called. So you take one of these sheets and you, you rip it apart apparently because I'm an idiot, but it doesn't matter, it's still going to work. These are just temporary. I tried using them long term and it doesn't work. So you can write on them, but if you leave the writing for too long, it's going to stick to it and you can have, never erase it basically. So I'm gonna put one of these on the wall and then you get a marker, which I've left somewhere around the office. So it might look like I'm writing on the wall, but it's not the wall. So what was on my to-do list? Set up Brita. See, you can write. And if you want, if you change your mind, oh no, it's not the Brita, it's something else, I wanna change it, you can just delete it. It's pretty nifty. I don't know if you can see, but I'm kind of writing on a thing. So yeah, I'm gonna make a to-do list and then we're gonna start doing items on those. So set up. I ordered this from Amazon, <laughs> just thinking it's a small router and when it arrived, like, there's only two rooms here and I don't even need Wi-Fi. What am I gonna do with this? Now, now I have to set it up, so. Ooh, it looks nice, I like it. Look at it, it's transparent. There, there's the thing, I just need to set up the cable somewhere. I almost threw out the manual. This is so, so important to read everything in, in, in details and make sure that we know how, how this thing. Item number one, set up water boiler. Whoop, done. Now we can set up the Brita. There it is. Let's put you somewhere. Why? Why so many nylons around the thing? Like, I don't fucking get it. Okay, so as I was saying, if you're not familiar with it, which I wasn't two, three years ago, Brita is one of the most popular brands for water filters, plastic key that you will find in offices and places. So the idea is you fill it with water, you put a filter in it, you get clear filtered water. No other philosophy other than that. This is the the thing for letting water flow through it. And then there's, I get three benefits or whatever. Oh, shut up. And I will put it in the middle of the thingy. It doesn't click in. Do I even have the right thing? Mm, this is annoying. I actually need the manual for the Brita. Once upon a time, someone's calling. One more thing that we need to set up in the office, and I just call, had a call with the landlord about it, is it's fucking freezing. I don't know what's with September and Poland, but it's so insanely cold it's here. It's annoyingly cold. So I went out right now with my bike to, to actually buy a heating panel thingy, and they were like, no, sorry, we just send them on, sell them online. So at least the bike ride there to the mall and back heated me up. So far, no electricity, no internet. Working outside of home sucks. I want my home and my kitchen and my dog. Yeah, let's read this manual. <laughs> Look at this. Who's gonna read this? This is my, my grandpa back in the day, like doing this with the newspaper. You know? And they're like, oh, cool. There's some information, something that happened in northern Switzerland that I don't care about. So, yeah, this Brita manual is a little bit useless because they included a manual for the device that's not my device. Fucking idiots that they are. So, I cannot do shit with this. I don't know. Let's find another part of the manual. Now, it would be useful if I had the basketball set up right now because I can just dunk this. Uh -huh. Nope, that didn't work. I knew it. The filter doesn't fit because it's not the filter for this thing. This is what they sent me. They sent me a filter for the regular one and this is what I need. Like the filter needs to look like this. <sighs> Companies, get your shit together. So now I cannot drink water. Uh, yeah, on to the next item because we cannot set up the bridge until I have a filter. Alexa. Remind me to order a proper Breda filter. 
Okay, Done. the moon is... I don't blame her, Brita is not very pronounceable. On to the next task. Last year I made this Frankenstein thing and I didn't record the process because th this was super interesting to make. It's like a moving camera sliding on wheels that has everything on it so I can slide my camera in here. I can attach whatever I need to attach. There's a power source cable attached to it. There's someone freaking calling me for the brilliant time. Hello, sweetums, pumpkin angel. What do you need? Yeah, so this is missing two important things. There, there were two sandbags that have to go uh, on the bottom. Otherwise, this will completely fall over. But I think I should rebuild this properly from scratch. So it's better to dismantle it and just start one by one. Otherwise, I think it's very messy. And I'm, I'm not, I'm not sure. We roll, roll, it did it, did it. Perfect. But my idea here is, if I have the camera right here in the corner, then the background will be this nice, like there's gonna be all the lights and everything in the background here. So, so th this is kind of like the perfect position for it. Plus, I can connect it to the Mac Studio right here, and I can use one of these two things to start and end recording, which is nifty. This is a part that's missing in the recording setup, and it has a little screen on it, so I can watch myself while, I, while I'm recording, and it has a big ring light. I bought this two years ago, three years ago maybe, it's a gimbal for professional, steady shots, whatever the hell. I've never used it, so I'm ambitiously keeping it in the office because maybe one day I will use it. Okay, next up on the list is router, and that's you, my friend. Now, let's unbox this puppy. I've never seen something this big. This will actually power a Wi-Fi powerful enough with a long range that I can actually use it at home and at the office at the same time. Like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> what did I order? And you know what's the best thing? Here's what's the idiotic thing. Me being into computers and technology and shit, I totally forgot that the computer, the, the internet company people, when they set up internet at the office, they also give you a, a, a router. So I thought it's, oh, it's a modem. So in the modem, I would have to get my own router. I fucking forgot that it's a router also and it would have been enough for the office. <laughs> Holy mother of gaming router. Like it looks like hella from, from Thor Ragnarok. Holy crap. Wi-Fi that's gonna be coming out of this thing. Why do you put it in such an annoying fucking, like look, you cannot take this out because, God. <sighs> yeah, okay. I don't know how these should be positioned. Probably up if I'm a man of um, physics and reason and logic and sense. So, this goes here. So, that was the setup from the router. I need to find a good place for it. I don't think this, this looks like something that I would have, I would like to have displayed in my office. Good, right? Clean, nobody can see it. I'm gonna plug it into other stuff later and the electricity is back. For now, I can just plug it in. And I guess that concludes the part of the router. It's not exactly finalized and set up, but it's enough for now. We can move on to the next task. Yeah, recording setup is kinda done-ish. I honestly wanna take these out. They're pissing me off, these, whatever the fuck they're called. To remove these. You know what I mean? Winky face, winky face. That's, that's, that's not a wing. Magically. And there you go. Clean cables and set up basketball. I cannot set up the basketball because I don't have nails. So clean the cables it is. I was in the middle of cleaning up cables while I heard the glorious sound of electricity in the city, which means that that also means the end of the video. Uh, let me show you how, <laughs> now that there's a light on, let me show you this disaster of this area. Like this needs to needs to go. This furniture will have to be removed. Like th this, is, this is a clusterfuck. I, I have a temporary place for these things, but this needs to look better. It needs to be revamped at some point because it's annoying. Here's my solution for the cable. If you're wondering how your boy solved it, and here's how the charger for the toothbrush is going to work. 
pretty nifty. You just attach the toothbrush there and, and, and it works fine. Well, that's the end of the video. The nice thing about not caring about YouTube metrics, growing a channel, picking the right thumbnail, making sure you put the right whatever things, record the right content that pleases the right amount of people who have an attention span of four seconds. So now you have to make shorts instead of like, I will record this type of videos and I'll record whatever the fuck I want. And if you guys like it and watch it, I'll just, actually, if you like it or dislike it or watch it or not watch it, I'll keep doing this type of videos without giving a flying saucer. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.